Title 2019. The students have been working very hard, planning out a wonderful program for you. So I would like to have you give a warm welcome Woo! to Edison. The enumeration in the Constitution of certain rights shall not be construed to deny or disparage others retained by the people. The federal government can't declare that a person has no other rights except those in the Bill of Rights. Amendment 10. The powers not delegated to the United States by the Constitution, no prohibited by it to the states are reserved and the states respectively are to the people. The federal government can't refuse to let the states make their own law. Now Addy will be doing her poll. Chase the shouting wind along its wall, my eager craft to full of souls of air. Up, up, the long, delirious, burning blue, I've tripped, topped 
the wind swept heights with easy grace, where never a lark or even evil flew, and with sunlight lifting my hand, I trod through the high untrespassed sanctity of space, put out my hand and touched the face of God. Now take the word of God. must think it clear and stop without a farmhouse near. Between the woods and frozen lake, the darkness seems lovely. He gives the song a bell to shake. To add that there is no mistake, the only other sound is the sweep of easy wind down the road. The woods are lovely, dark and deep, but I have promises to keep. And miles ago, before I sleep, and miles ago, before I sleep. Snowflake is the king of prisoners. Do you like surprise? Examine him three times his size. At first you won't believe your eyes. Stars look alike, but flakes do not. No two the same in all the lot. That you will get in any spot. He chanced to be for everyone comes spinning through the sky his done. But his own window brings the sun, joins points and crosses. What can make such lace work with no crack or break in billions, billions, no mistake? Sunbooks. If sunlight felt like snowflakes, gleaming yellow, so bright, we could blow the sun in, we could have a sunball fight. We could watch the sun flakes drifting in the sky, we could go slaying in the middle of July. We could ride a sunmobile, and we could touch sunflakes, I wonder how they'd feel. That's a good idea. The story of the Trojan horse comes from a war between the Greek and the people of Troy, where way back in the 12th century before Christ. The war began when a Trojan prince named Paris kidnapped Helen, the beautiful wife of Menelaus, who was the king of Sparta and Greece. The return of Helen was demanded, but the Trojans refused, so Menelaus persuaded his brother Agamemnon to lead an army against Troy. After a long siege, which lasted 10 years, the Greeks decided to come, go back home to Greece, pretending that a huge horse they had built on the beach was a gift to the goddess Athena, who had helped them. The Greeks didn't really leave, though. Some of the Greek warriors hid inside the horse. The Trojans thought the horse was a gift from the gods, so they pulled the horse inside the gates of Paris. <coughs> At night, the Greek warriors snuck out and opened the gates for the other Greeks, warriors hiding in, bush, in the bushes. Things turned out very badly for the Trojans. The title of this very long story is the Iliad. Drayton's first song is Happy Birthday.
Good job. Good job. Jacob's first song is Nine the Lady.
I'll be playing Echo Series in E major. <laughs>
Pension Klein. Pension Klein. Thank <laughs> you. 